Hey guys, your friendly neighborhood Natty here. My name is Matthew. And today we're going to start, um, what is this, Rise of the Tomb Raider? Yes. <laughs> um, I beat the first one a long time ago, and then I bought this one, and I bought the other one too, Shadow. Um, we're actually on the Xbox 360 right now. <laughs> um, I got Tomb Raider, and then Rise of the Tomb Raider on 360, and then Shadow is actually on Xbox One. So, yes, I already 100% the first one, um, and then finally I think we have time we can come back to this one so um i already checked the options let's go to new game we'll have to choose an empty one. Oh, combat difficulty well so survivor is the hardest one huh adventure is the easiest one good balance difficulty we'll just do normal Ooh, it's snowing. What yeah. makes someone reach beyond the boundaries of human experience to face the unknown? As children, we question the world around us. We learn, we accept, and gradually we lose our capacity for wonder. But some do not. The explorers, the seekers of truth. It is these pioneers who define the future of mankind. The others, they're done. No amount of money's gonna get them through those mountains. The lost city's up there, somewhere. That's gonna be a hell of a climb. I'm not turning back. I know. You should stay here with them. Not a chance. That's my boy Jonah. I was about to call him Noah. I was like, wait a second, what's his name? It's been a long time since I played the first one. Long time. <laughs> That's really all you need? Just two of those axes? Wait till you see this view, Lara. Take my hand. Thanks. Look at that. It's amazing. But the snow coming off those peaks is a bad sign. Oh, I can move. The trail leads up the mountain. We'll have a good view of the valley beyond from the summit. All right. Let's take it easy here. What about all my other friends? <laughs> From the ship. This wind is crazy. We just need to keep moving. Hey, even if we don't find anything up here, your dad would be proud. I know, but I have a good feeling about this. Getting windy. A little too windy. Oh my god. X. Damn. That was close. Laura! Press A? Jonah! Save and grab? I'm here! I'll climb down there and get you! I'll keep going. No! Whee! It's too dangerous! Jump over to the next ledge. Nice. Climbable good. walls. Craggy walls. Nice. What about this way? Okay. Climb here. Axe attach. Can I jump in and... Yeah! <laughs> Just like the first one. Uh oh, what do I do? I'll go to the side. Okay. Okay. Guessing I jumped to the left now. <laughs> I need to jump across. I, I figured. Okay. Now grab my hand. Give me Jonah. Give me Jonah. <laughs> gotcha. Shit, Lara. You're gonna give me a heart attack. 
Are you okay? Yeah. Come on. Why why do we come here? <laughs> this better be worth it. Oh I got 50 experience. Looks like you gotta go through. You know, we've had a really weird winter here in South Dakota. I think we had four snow days, and that's it. <laughs> we haven't had any more snow since then. Do you really think we'll find this lost city? I know this is a long shot, but that old tracker said he saw ruins up in these mountains. Lost city of what? Maybe Atlantis. Is that one? I guess if I was gonna hide a lost city, this might be the kind of godforsaken place I do it. Cause the last game wasn't Atlantis, it was something Should else. Should be enough time. We're almost to the top. It was like Himiko's Sun Island. <laughs> what do you think? We're close to something, Jonah. I can feel it. Just his last stretch to the top. All right. Let's see what's up there. Come with me, bruh. Let's go, bruh. Feels pretty solid here, but keep close to the wall. Okay. I gotta go now. Oh, jeez, okay. Looks like we climb from here. We're gonna jump. Okay, how's this anchor gonna work though? He's attached to me. Okay, good. Okay. Let's take it slow and steady. Just stay with me. Here it comes! Look out! Oh! Oh shit! That was close! Jump up? Okay. And jump across? Uh huh. Jump up again. I need to look up, please. Am I going across? No. Here we go! Oh, oh! Holy shit! I don't think I can make that jump. Stay there. I'll anchor a line for you at the top. All right. I'll give you some slack. Oh, thank you. I'm gonna need it. Almost there, Laura. You got it. Okay. <gasps> I feel like this kind of climb would be fun. Like indoors, you know? <laughs> I feel like I'd be good at rock climbing. I only did it like twice. We made it! I see the ruins! Oh, oh god. No. Oh. The weather! Jeez! Jonah. One more time, Jonah! Wee! Oh man. No. No. Jonah, let's go! <sighs> okay, I need one more. I need one more, bro. Hey! Let me jump! <laughs> I was gonna jump, like I feel like that's the only way to make it. Okay, I'm climbing! Ooh. Oh, shit. Oh, God damn it. Go back, Jonah. Get to shelter. 
Run! Oh, what do I do? Jump? Whoa, she jumps far. <laughs> I don't think I can jump that far. Whee! It's quite an avalanche. I'm gonna jump on this thing! Whoa! Okay. <laughs> oh! There we go. Um, I'm gonna go on the right, right? Yep! <laughs> uh, let me think about it. Okay, okay. Let's go. Oh no. Let's still go. Yep. Yep. Okay. Whee! Oh, we're still going. Yep. Here we go! <laughs> oh, jeez. Dang. Oh, dang. Am I okay? Am I still alive? Oh, in England. London. I guess that's where she's from, huh? It is the greatest cruelty of life that we're all too swiftly taken from it. We age, we decay, we die. What do we leave behind? Bones? Dust? What of the soul? Does it endure beyond our earthly existence? I believe it does. A truth lies at the heart of many myths and stories. A truth not of science, but something more profound. The key to unlocking everlasting life. I may have found the next piece to the puzzle, but I'm not alone in this search. They're following me, watching my every step. I know them by name now. Trinity, an ancient violent sect with designs on controlling the future of humanity. I must proceed carefully for the sake of my family. If anything were to ever happen to Lara or Anna, I could never forgive myself. Breaking into my papa's studio? Hmm? Someone's here, because <laughs> the window is open. Come on. Not just me. was attacking you again. I thought you could use some company. No lies. Were you followed? Followed? Of course not. What's going on? I think I found the tomb. Oh, you can't be serious. The myth of the prophet is real. Dad was right. Lara, your father was unwell. No, he was close to a great discovery, tangible evidence of the immortal soul. I loved Richard. I would have married him if he'd asked. But he was a broken man. 
I don't want to see you end up like him. But Anna, he was right. It was everyone else who was wrong. The tomb's in Syria. Syria? Oh God, Laura, no. This is madness. Get your life sorted. Go home to the manor. You know I can't go back there. But this obsession ruined your father. I saw something. Something I... I can't explain. Now I understand what Dad was going through. It's all fairy tales. Nonsense. Don't go down this road. You know where it leads. It's the only thing that makes sense to me now. I'm going to find the Prophet's tomb, Anna. Does that snow in Syria, though? I mean, I don't know. I'm just an American, but... <laughs> I don't know. Does it ever snow in the Middle East? Probably. I know it's... It gets hot and must get cold, right? Hey, we're heading into a war zone now. We better be sure about this. We're close. There should be an oasis in the canyon just ahead. You're wasting your time. There's nothing out here. Just keep driving, please. It's your money. Well, it's your money, too. I paid you. <laughs> Something isn't right. Oh, that's just local militia. I don't think so. You told someone, didn't you? They, they paid better than you. You <laughs> Shit, they weren't supposed to shoot at us. Get us out of here. Yeah, I imagine. <laughs> but then they wouldn't have to pay you if you're dead, so. <laughs> Oh, more fire. Oh, he's dead. Okay. Well, thanks for hanging out with me <laughs> for a little bit. We've arrived at your destination. What about my backpack? Oh, she didn't. You could have taken your backpack too, come on. Dang, too much traumas. Too much damage, you guys. We're at the northwest border of Syria. Holy cow. No turning back. It has to be here. For ruins in the cliff, huh? Hmm. Okay. Oh, I'm dizzy. I got a concussion. Oh, what what gun do I have? It looks like a madam. Uh, 1911. Ooh. Hold on. Let me let me see my martial arts, please. You gotta show me. It's not a document. It's not a relic. Okay. Well. Ain't gonna tell me what gun I got, huh? Kind of, you know, it looks like a 1911 with a compensator. It's infinite? Ooh! Or is that a suppressor? Jeez, Laura! <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> That's some serious weaponry. Okay. You know what's interesting? There was something in Dad's research about this. It was said the Prophet's tomb was hidden in the cliffs above one of the forgotten cities. Legend speaks of an oasis where the Prophet was laid to rest. I was gonna say, um, in South Dakota, you know, suppressors were treated the same way as like, um, short-barreled rifles and short-barreled shotguns. But recently, maybe not just South Dakota, maybe it was Minnesota too, I think. They've taken it off, off the list. Hold up, what do I do? <laughs> I was about to jump to the side, and I was like, oh, I don't think it's a good idea. But they were taken off the um, NFA list, so you don't have to pay a $200 tax stamp for it. Something's here. I'm not 100% sure. I don't shoot suppressors very often, so I'm, you know, <clears throat> I'm more of an iron sights, revolver, double action kind of a guy, so those are my weapon of choices. Ooh, a box. 
What do I get? A religious icon. Detailed and inlaid with gems. It looks Byzantine, perhaps 10th century. It fits with the legend of the prophet. Byzantine, huh? That's like a old time period. <clears throat> In the Middle East, I guess. Cool. Could this really be it? My glow stick. Gotta have my glow stick. Okay. What is this now? These are the miracles of the prophet of Constantinople, unjustly murdered by order of Trinity. Hmm. Greek. Oh boy. This is, this is all too intelligent for me, guys. <laughs> it's much easier to just practice martial arts. Oh my goodness. Okay, that's what we looked at, right? Do we come from this side? Yes. Yeah, that's where we came from. Okay. <laughs> Gotta draw the map in my mind. So then, let's see what... Mm, it's some sort of marker. Oh, I have to... Byzantine script, advance for Greek translation. Jeez. Speaking with a foreign army, he convinced them to lay down their weapons. I mean, it doesn't really work that way, but okay. <laughs> um, I think that's the way forward. So let's um, let's 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 talk about this. Okay, he's shown here performing healing miracles. Dad's notes mention this. So another dude that is supposed to be Jesus, huh? <laughs> Another Jesus after Jesus? Nah. Wait, she's level one Greek, right? So she can read it now. Mm, my Greek is still a little rusty, but it's pointing to something hidden nearby. Oh, Mark. Mark any item, any map item with a player beacon. Players appear blue. Right here. <laughs> yeah, this thing, right? <laughs> I saw that, so I want to check it last. He led his followers through the desert to the oasis. Mm hmm. Now we can break this. Yeah! The secret entrance. Hmm? Okay. Wow, look at the city. So nice. It's amazing. If only Dad could have seen this. Into the Prophet's tomb. Objective beacon. Ooh. Nice. I don't think I want to go down there. Still got my infinite suppressor. <laughs> oh, jump to wall and scramble. Scramble mid jump of flat walls. Oh, jeez. 
Some people's athleticism, I tell you. You saw. Yeah, we're gonna go across. There we go. Oh, Laura. There we go. Oh no, they're already here. Got to get inside. <laughs> okay. Oh snap! Oh snap! Is it jumping time? Whee! Is it jumping time again? Oh boy. Uh, let's jump over here and over here. Oh my gosh! <laughs> Yeah, a little closer, I think. Whee! Okay. All right. The Order of Trinity pursued the Prophet and his people relentlessly until finally confronting them in their hidden oasis. A way through. I'm out. Oh, hi. <laughs> he really likes his shield. Can't let it go. It's important to him. Oh. Ew. Uh, go forth, madam. <laughs> Hiya! Oh, following in father's footsteps. Okay. There was a battle here. Armed soldiers against religious pilgrims. The Order of Trinity. Oh. Gift of Alms. Must be something. Well, I don't know if we craft anything. I don't think we did that in the old game. What is this? My son. The Order of Trinity has received word that the Prophet's followers are building a great tomb at an oasis outside Berea. But more upsetting, while we thought they were building the tomb for their Prophet, Trinity now believes he still lives. We have learned he is preaching his heresy among the local citizens, drawing more to him daily with his tales of how he conquered death. He is a liar and a heretic, claiming miracles that come only from the divine. You swore he was dead. Have you failed us? Hmm. Bishop Word from Rome. Hey, soldiers, huh? I feel like it'd be cool to check out the armor and the weapons, but just me, I guess. The prophet slain by the order of Trinity. <sighs> okay, so Ooh, cool sword. Can I first person? No. Well, it's a pretty long sword, jeez. <laughs> oh, hi. Oh, it's a trap. Damn it. That was too close. Oh, okay. Better watch out for traps, huh, guys? Blasting their way in. 
We got a blaster of our own. <laughs> Not as good as theirs, but... There's water behind there. Should be able to raise the level if I break through. Oh, do I just walk up to it? <laughs> that's what I, okay, okay. I was just shooting it like, um, <laughs> I feel like that's what I should do. No! Let me over there, let me over there. Okay. We'll go up here. Swim faster. Oh, swim faster. Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> Come on now. Da -da 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 -da. Ooh. I feel like there was probably other stuff there that we probably missed, but we're just playing for fun, so it's okay. <laughs> Can I go back? <laughs> oh. Can I dive? Laura? What? Oh, there she goes. Oh, okay. Oh, uh, uh, madam. Can you get lower? Oh, wait. Oh, I'm running out of oxygen. It's okay. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> All right. Wow, look at that. Stunning. We made it, Dad. Okay, so... Um... Navigate to the top of the main tomb chamber. Okay, when you dive, can you like... Can she go lower or what? I don't think she can go lower. Oh no! Oxygen! <laughs> oh jeez! Woo! Okay, activates your full instinct. Right, so... Got to find a way to get up higher. Maybe I can raise the water. We're raising the water again? <sighs> With that, okay. Alright, and then... Don't you need to be coming down? Apparently not. Alright, well, <clears throat> let's raise the water then. That's it? Come on. Well, at least it gives me access to right here. Jump onto that. That's 
loose gate is holding the water back. I wonder if I can lift it. From that side? Okay, let's see if we can jump it. Hey! Oh, shit. Nice. Oh, hey! Oh, no! Oh, okay. I guess we want that, huh? <laughs> you guys know I'm curious though. I wonder if there's something on the other side. I, I got to know. Well, she'll do it. Whee! <laughs> okay. Wait a second. Is there something here though? Oh, what's this? Ancient coins. Nice. Traded for upgraded coins? I feel like. They're worth more than that. What's this? Lara? My lord, what you say is impossible. I myself drove a spear into the Prophet's heart. I saw him die. Doubtless, his people have propped another man up in the slain Prophet's robe to continue his lies. They are broken, discredited, and exiled. We will head south, and put the rest of his people to the sword. But the prophet is dead. This, I swear. So you say. Okay. I thought we didn't even have to swing to the right at all. We could have just... Taking the left side over here, huh? We got something. Hang on. Gold incense burners, huh? Is this where I came from? We got something else. Ice! This is the only way. I have to go under. I don't see anything here, though. Okay. <laughs> Alright, you know what? Let's let's swing to the right this time. Oh. Okay, here we go. There we go. Is that the front side of it, though? I got it, though. Oh, yeah, it is. Okay, good. <laughs> I'll accept that, then. That's okay. I'm fine with that. Oh, no. We're gonna go up here. Oosh! Press A to jump! <laughs> Oh no! Alright. Well, um. Jump past this? Alright. Is that the final jump? Damn! They're almost inside. Come on. Alright, well, let's get this one. Nope. <laughs> My lord, I ride at the head of a small army of the faithful. 
armed and ready. And I have good news. We have located the Tomb of the Prophet. We were attacked by madmen upon the road wearing the Prophet's livery, but they were easily bested. We allowed one to flee and followed him back to the Oasis. Whether the Prophet escaped death or whether another now wears his mantle, it does not matter. All will perish inside, and it will become a tomb at last. Let me charge my computer so it doesn't die. I always forget to do that. <clears throat> it's probably easier to do than I think it is. But I just forget all the time. It happens when you get old, guys. <sighs> Don't get old. <sighs> okay, let's see. These boys are coming in, huh? Let me hit that thing. I don't know why. Okay. Whee! Oh! <laughs> um, I may have forgotten. <laughs> I tell you what, when I heard the sound, I was kind of like, mm, I think I know what that means, but I missed it. Okay, okay. They give you a little bit of a second. Whee! Okay. I will uh, teach myself next time. Pizza! What is that switch? It's another trap switch, though. Oh, 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 I need to shoot the thing on my jiggies. <laughs> oh, that was too close. Okay, okay. Hmm. Another one. My lord, the last remnant of the prophet's followers have barricaded themselves inside his tomb. We have made camp at the entrance, and we are preparing to break through their barricades. I saw the man claiming to be the prophet before they sealed the gates. And I admit, he bears a striking resemblance. But it could not be. No matter. They will all be dead before sunrise. The Order of Trinity will see that his heresy ends here. <laughs> Oh, I can translate level two Greek. Look how smart I am. Okay, so we want to go downstairs. Got to raise the water. Right. We can shoot this down. Oh, hi. Oh, sh oh, sh <laughs> okay. Oh, we're raising the water, though. Hmm. Gonna be a quick jump, huh? Okay. I got it, I got it. Okay. Oh, we found something again. Oh, that's uh, that's the money? That's the currency of this place, huh? Let me see. Hold up, hold up. 
Okay, I was wondering if there was something there, but that's just me. So we do stand on this. Whoa! And then I go to this one. And then I go to this one. Got it. Got it. Uh, I jump on that. Wait a second. For real? If I could get out onto that bar. Go ahead. <laughs> ah, okay. Oh, there you go. Okay, let's see. That's the tomb, huh? Empty. Oh no! It's empty. No, no. What did I miss? Hey, down here! Oh snap! I would take y'all's weapons when you're dead. <laughs> Set the charges. The prophet's tomb. After all this time. And the artifact? Inside. God willing. He's been shot through his hand. Open it. Carefully. It could be extremely dangerous. Sure it is. Uh, yes it is. Who the hell are you? You're a smart woman. I suspect you already know. Trinity. Where is the artifact? I don't know what you're talking about. Don't play games with me. You led us to this place. Look, it was empty when I got here. There was no body and definitely no artifact. Got it. <laughs> Jeez. Oh, here we go. Oof. Sorry. Oh man. Oh man. I'm just barely missing every time, guys. I should probably go, huh? Okay, that's good. Whee! Oh, X. Oh, it's like...
and went back home. Find the prophet's tomb. Yes, but I was followed. What? By who? They call themselves Trinity. They tried to kill me. What the hell is going on here? You're starting to scare me. The tomb was empty, but I think they were looking for the divine source. The, the artifact your father was after? There's more. I found this symbol in the tomb. I knew I'd seen it before. It was driving me insane. That's when it hit me. I saw it here. In one of Dad's books. Listen to this. The lost city of Katesh, said to have disappeared in Siberia sometime in the 12th century. Legend says that on the eve of the invasion by the Mongol horde, it sunk beneath a lake. What does this have to do with the Prophet's artifact? The same symbol. <laughs> Laura. <laughs> if the divine source is hidden in the ruins of Katesh, waiting to be found, then I have to go. To Siberia? Are you kidding me? Just think. If this thing could really unlock the secret of immortality, it would... it would change everything. Sickness, suffering, death, gone. Are you listening to yourself? Jonah, we've been through so much together. You know there's more out there. This could be real. I don't care if it's real. I've lost too many friends. I don't want to lose you too. Dad never made the connection to Katash. He gave up everything for this. Including you. Stop blaming yourself for what happened. He made his own bed. I can't give up on him. Not now. It's all I have. No, it isn't. If you stayed still for five minutes, maybe you'd see that. Boy didn't care. <laughs> Zoo! He gone. Shit, Laura. What are we gonna do? I led them to it, Jonah. If the divine source is real, we've got to find it first. Siberia it is then. Well, that's how we got here. Where's my boy Jonah? Jonah, if you can hear me, go back. Please don't try to find me. I'm freezing. I need to do this alone. Even though I take cold showers like 
every day, so I'm good. But <laughs> it's funny, you never get used to it. You really don't. Got to find Cold shelter. welcome. Can I just say the last fight scene in the in the CG movie was really good. It was also realistic because she basically lost to that guy. And let me tell you, like the number of girls that join the dojo and they think they can match a man is like unreasonably high. And I know that's the fault of like movies and TV shows thinking that a girl can match a guy. Now listen, I'm not saying a girl can't match a guy. I think if it's like a um, an equal martial art like a gun, then a girl can do it, you know. But if a guy and a girl learn the sword and the spear, uh, anything else, uh, punching, kicking, she's going to lose. You know, even if they practice the same amount of time, 10, 10, 20, 30 years, it doesn't matter. You know what I mean? So I kind of appreciate it. This game was made, what, 2015? Yeah, 2015. You know what I mean? Like, there's still, I would say, kind of like, like realism. And I always say, too, it's like, oh, you know, what the girls do in this situation is don't be in the situation. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, you don't want to be trying to match a man. It's just not a good idea. You know, and the fact that that guy was like an average dude, like, that's real. You know what I mean? Like, like trained girls in martial arts can still lose to average guys. So I, I just got to say, I appreciate that. That's probably not going to be true after two, 2015. You know, girls think kind of crazy things. They can, they can beat a guy, but... It's refreshing to see that from something uh, almost a decade ago. So, um, now of course too, like, you know, there are things that girls can do that like, like, I don't know, for a guy, like, we wouldn't do it, you know, like, when the guy was choking Laura, she had a pretty good opening to his, uh, his genitals, you know, and then girls have long nails, they can dig into the skin, you know, eyes, stuff like that, so. Come I'm, on, you can do this, move. So, you know, we don't blame girls when they, when they use that, that's fine, you know. But to say like, oh yeah, the girl can just match the guy 100%, that's absolute okay. insanity. <laughs> I've never had a master told me that, that a girl could match a guy, unless it was a gun. Then she could match him. But anything else? No. Absolutely not. So, we can start a fire, maybe. Okay. <laughs> Got to start a fire. Alright, well, I need tinder. Gather resources to build a fire and shelter. There's tinder. Well, there's three things. Wait, I don't have my gun? Oh my gosh. That's the only thing I care about. Hmm. That's pretty important, but I don't know if I'm supposed to do that to get that. Well, let's see. There was three more over there. Need resources to build a shelter. I see. We're gonna have to see what we can find. Ooh! Here's some. Yeah. Okay. That's my work. We need some more too. Not enough to last the night. Uh, need to gather more. One more. Dry enough to burn. I hope. Come on. Right there. What? Fresh kill. No meat, but maybe something else I can use. Oh, snap. <gasps> okay. Turn to Back camp. To camp. Okay. I will. Does she have a tinder kit on her though? Like, gotta start the fire with something. Move, damn it. Come on. You can do it. You can do it. Here, we'll find it. 
And what of the remnant? They continue to resist us, but we'll have the situation in hand soon enough. Good. Trinity has faith in you. Trinity. Trinity is here. They are, are they not? Oh, going back to the bow and arrow, huh? Makeshift longbow. I wish this pain wasn't so familiar. Like looking an old enemy in the eye. It wants to take me down. It wants me to just lie down and die. But I won't. I can't. There's something here. There must be, or Trinity wouldn't be in this snowy hell. I Very. just hope that Jonah is okay. That he found a way back. I, I just couldn't risk having him with me. Not again. The pain of losing him, that would be too much to bear. This is my path, and mine alone. Going to need a stronger bow. Okay, so alternate outfits. Change large attire to best suit your adventure. Also, outfits available and locked by person to the game. Um, some outfits get, give gameplay benefits. Oh, sweet outfit at base camp. I think we got outfits. We have a makeshift longbow. Bare bones, bow crafted from sticks, simply a dependable. Mm. But they're probably not going to give me a gun in a long time, huh? Wrap strength. Grip. Reinforced limbs. What is the resource list? We have four hide and four hardwood, so we can upgrade it. Okay. Um, how do I, madam? Oh, I think they want me to make it. Okay. <laughs> okay, sure. Reinforced limbs. Stronger limbs allow for increased string tension, faster arrow speeds, and more damage. Apply to all bows. Yes. Thank you. Can't do any more with that, can I? Now can I look at something else? Yes. Axe. Can I do anything with the axe? I could have chose this instead, but it's okay. Leashed handle. What kind of outfits do we have? Switch between multiple weapons of the same type. Using weapons menu. Each weapon has unique stats and upgrades. Uh, expedition. Modern winter coat. Red and black palette. Okay. White out jacket. Keeps cool and blend in the snowy surroundings. Not a bad idea, really. A blue Henley. Loose Reeve retains heat, but allows for breathability. That might be good, too. Leather jacket. Casual clothing. Can I see these? Oh, yes. <laughs> so it's the same as the first one. It's white color. What's a blue Henley? Oh, okay. It's, it's nice. Um, leather jacket. Ooh, I like leather jackets. Not my idea of leather, it's okay. Immortal Guardian, what? Oh, I don't have this. You have to pay for it. Ancient dark metal armor with a bare fur cowl. Attire suited for the elite guardians of Kitesh. Reduces damage from Greek fire. Can I see it at least? Immortal Guardian. Ooh. Like the old times, huh? Ancient Vanguard, woven chain mail. Chain mail. And knitted le long sleeve shirt with leather straps. Solid protection for any adventure. Reduces delay before health begins regenerating. Oh, okay. Siberian Ranger! Long sleeve shirt and tactical vest. Increased carrying capacity of special ammunition. Very useful. I like that idea. Nightshade. Hide garb from very soft skin. They send it with simple scarf for warmth. Chance of looting an exotic animal resource from a common animal. Well, that's pretty neat. Well, geez, um, I'd say 
I'd say I'm stuck between the Henley or the leather jacket, even though the leather jacket's not really my idea of a leather jacket. Wait, wait, change. Change! <laughs> you gotta look at it one more time. I mean, that's alright, it's nice. And the leather jacket is under a dark leather jacket, casual clothing for a simpler life. I, I guess Blue Henley's okay. Yeah. Okay. It's not gonna keep us warm though. <laughs> Weapons and inventory. Skills. We have one skill point available. Equipment. Hunter's Quiver. Increases carry capacity for arrow types. Adventurer's Quiver. Well, okay, more arrows, right? Satchel. Increases resource storage capacity. Satchel, again. Rucksack. Resource carrying capacity. I feel like that'd be a good idea to have. Oh, shotgun shells. Bandolier. Damn. Hey, I got one of those. I got one of those guys. <laughs> the shotgun shell bandolier, I have that. Rifle and ammo pouch. Mm hmm. Large rifle ammo pouch. Pistol ammo pouch. Large pistol ammo pouch. For carrying more bullets. Not a bad idea. Silent arrows. Jeez. Okay. Wait, let me see one more thing. Special ammunition. But all I have is just the arrows. Okay. Okay, fine. How about skills? Should we buy a skill? Hand-to-hand -hand combat and healing. Hunter and survivor. It takes less damage from enemy gunfire and melee attacks. Iron hide from explosions and fire. Incapacitate unarmed enemies, unarmored enemies, while dodging with a well-timed press of the white button. But it's only unarmored enemies. Enemies killed while in stealth automatically looted the resources. Yeah, but you can just press the button too, right? Arrow retrieval. Mm -hmm. Steady aim time on bow. Ammunition looted from enemy corpses. Animals glow. Animal instincts might not be bad. Faster crafting of throwable objects and ammo. Enemies killed or knocked out from crafted handheld hand objects. Craft explosive bombs from red gas cans and deadly proximity mines. Jeez. Land safely without damage. Learn bonus experience. Embarrassments for all caches, documents. Huh. Find challenge objects more easily. I feel like Avid Learn is a good idea. But I also like the Hunter one. Um, Animal instincts? Yeah, that's not bad. Hmm. But then average learner helps us level up faster, so we get the skills faster, right? Dragonfire. Jeez. Hmm, it's tough guys. It's tough, tough, tough. I can't decide. Um Let's go with the animals first. I think that'd be better. Animal instincts. New skill master. All right. Okay. What is next? Explore the forest, huh? Tougher than she looks. Hunting. Hold up. Yeah, what's that? Can I get that? Oh! What am I doing? <laughs> what am I doing? Hmm. Whee! Okay, some resources over here. Hardwood. 
Not bad. Let's go in the other direction. Oh, here's another one. Another one. Uh, madam. There we go. this oh, let's go up here first <laughs> Feathers. Okay. Once again, we got one of these. Oh, oh! Oh, wait, this deer is. He got nothing from me. Um... Oh, there's another deer right there, too. Um, hold on. Hold up, hold up. Jeez. Okay, is that something over there? Oh, it's okay. I think we can get that later. We can get that later. Who saw? Oh boy. What do we get? Some hide. Raw hide. And some feathers. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Ooh. No, nope, and the deer goes away. I saw you anyway, sir. It's okay. Jeez. Um, let's gather this resource. Okay. You know the Henley, this Henley shirt. I just reckon I realized a friend of mine, Kyle. I think he loves Henleys. <laughs> He has like a lot of those, you know? Maybe like two or three. It's his favorite shirt. Now I feel like I should get one. Um, didn't I see something? Was it this that I saw? Mm, maybe it was. I thought I saw something else though. Hmm. Let's uh let's try again. I think I I think I did see something, but I didn't go for it. Oh well, no, I did. Right? Because I went this way. Oh, that must have been what it was, I guess. Hmm. You know, I'm not 100% convinced. Oh, we can get that too. Ugh! I don't know how many resources we're trying to get here, but um, certainly a lot more. I think we'll go check out this side now. I know we saw something. Over here. I thought we did. Oh, there we go. Oh yeah. Rope arrows. Up, oh, open, please. <laughs> Let's 
Satchets revealed cave entrances. Really? Survival cash. Got a deer. What the hell is that? Entrances and exits, huh? Okay. In a cave. Here's a cave, but I don't have a rope for it. There's another cave. Okay, well. Wait, is that another, is that another feather? Oosh. Okay. Oh yeah, that's a cave entrance, all right. <gasps> Let's go check it out. <laughs> oh, magnesite. Guns or explosives? Um, <laughs> I have an arrow. I don't think that's going to do it. Let's try. Ah. Okay. Well, that cave was a bust. It's just, just a feather laying down here. That's another feather right there. And there was the um, 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 oh, right there. I knew I saw it, I just don't remember camouflaging too well. Wait, there was a deer here. Where's the deer? Should be a little bit past me. Oh, it's not updated real time on the map. Oh, damn. These ruins here. Mongolian. Oh, there's the deer. You ass boy. Oh! Ooh. Excuse me? Trinity, they're here. I'm trying to focus on deer hunting, okay? Oh shit. What the hell was that? I think that's a bear. All right, well, um... Okay, okay, okay. All right. I don't have that much arrows. Maybe I should have made some more. I could. Are you serious? <laughs> okay. <gasps> there we go. And what do we have? Money. For a year I have ridden with an army of Mongols, as envoy from the Order of Trinity. The Khan is a great warlord, despite his heathen ways. Under my influence, I have helped them topple nations, burn cities, and kill princes. All in search of the Prophet. Our slaughter of the Rus was not in vain, for among the spoils we at last found the map. And now, this very morning, after a season in the mountains, we saw buildings rising from a green valley surrounded by ice. We have found Kitesh. I tell the Khan of the riches that will be his, and that alone drives him on. 
But the real victory will be for God when we purge the prophet's lies from the earth. And at last, the divine source will be ours. You want to know something, guys? Um, the thing about immortality is kind of like, depending on, you know, your interpretation is like, we kind of already have it. Let me explain. <laughs> so, usually our bodies, you know, we're mostly digesting food, right? Like all the time, because we have breakfast, lunch, and dinner, and you know, that was the way that our grandfathers and parents were taught, and that's, that's fine, that's fine, you know. Um, but it would seem that when you're eating all the time, you know, a constant schedule, breakfast, lunch, and dinner, your body is focused on digesting the food, which takes a lot of energy, surprisingly, you know, just to get something from it, hopefully, if you're eating healthy, <laughs> you know, get all the vitamins and resources out of it. And so, the body never has time to conduct maintenance, right? So this is where the fasting part comes in, when you don't eat. So there's a fasting, there's dry fasting, things like that. So fasting is no food, dry fasting is no water, no, no food and water. And, you know, after some time, you know, it may depend on the genetics. Like some people may just do the maintenance after like 8 hours or 10 hours or 14 hours. You know, I tend to do 19 dry fast. Um, I can't say if it works or not unless, you know, you think I look exactly like a 35 year old. I don't know, but, you know, essentially... When the body's not digesting food all the time, it can actually maintain. It'll maintain usually by just kind of looking or what you have already and just being like which cells are functioning optimally, you know, and if they are, they leave it alone. If some are not, then your body will actually break it down. It'll destroy it and it'll build a new one. Now again, it's going to be different for everybody, you know, they could be at 10 hours, 12 hours, 15 hours, who really knows? Because um, <clears throat> everyone's body is just far too different to to be. No, let's put on a leather jacket. I don't think it's it looks good, but it's okay. I think that's probably her normal thing when she was like back home in, in England. Do we need to make more arrows? I feel like we do. Let me see. Yeah, we're not going to be able to craft anything useful, I don't think. Ammunition, silent arrows. Oh, that's what the feathers are for. Okay. Usha. So, how many arrows do I have though? Oh, and we have a, a skill point available too. That's great. Well, the other one I wanted was um. Well, wait, did I unlock a new one for Hunter? No. Okay, well then I guess we'll get the avid learner one then. Yes. Okay, cool. Okay. Alright, so... I think we have most of the resources here. But yes, as I was saying, you know, depending on your interpretation, we may already have immortality. You know, it's just that nobody is willing to, to put in the work, you know. So, you know, fasting every day. Again, the hours are different. Mine is 19. I do 19. I used to do 23. I used to do 23, but the problem there was that, you know, sometimes Papa Natty, Big Brother Natty want to buy me something, buy some food, eat together. And I always had to turn them down, you know, and so that's... Not, not, <laughs> not a good feeling for him, so eventually I relented and I was like, okay, well, you know, I don't expect them to make time for a one hour, you know, make dinner one hour, eat, make dinner and eat in one hour, ridiculous. So I kind of backed off and went back to 19, so, you know, I've stuck with that ever since. Um, I, again, I can't say for certain if I can feel, oh, you boy, you boy, come here, boy. Ah. Maybe I should like be stealthy. Wait, why can't I crouch? Okay, let's uh let's let's you know, let's just follow him for a little bit. 
Just a little bit, a little bit. Okay, all right, just... Laura, why can't you crouch? Not like that. All right, let's just... Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Where'd he go? I lost my dinner, guys. <laughs> I lost my venison. Hush. Oh, I see your ass. Na 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 na. Oh. Oh, I hit him, but he's not dead. Oh, he's, he's struggle bussing. He's struggle bussing. <laughs> okay. Oh, I just get hide? But you don't give me no food, though? Okay, okay. Okay, okay. I think we can go on. Um, so where do I need to go? Oh, a monolith. Okay. These characters look Mongolian. Oh, I can't but translate. I can't read what it says. Damn it! I'm not smart enough. Wait, was there another cave? I know we can't go to the one that we back here. Explore satchel. <laughs> He's dead. Oh wait, there's something here. Survival cache. Yeah, that's where the other cave is. We'll try to... Can I mark it? Okay. But I'll get the survival cache for now, which is supposed to be around here somewhere. Wasn't it? It was around here somewhere. Oh, jeez. So, turn the left some more. It's right in front of me. It's right in front of my face. Uh oh, 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 here we go. <laughs> jeez. <laughs> I just got some hardwood. Okay, so that cave was blocked, right? Yeah, by like explosives and then rope arrow. We got the deer. Oh, here's another survival cache. Maybe I should get all these first. Wait, why can't I mark it? Should I unmark you first? Now can I mark you? Ah, oh, sh. Okay. We're gonna go to the survival cache. We'll get the two first, okay? Whoa! Did I see something? Oh, I just, the monolith? Okay. I can't read Mongolian yet. Not good enough. But no, if you guys ever want to be immortal, I mean, all you have to do is fast for a very long time. No alcohol, no drugs. <laughs> I know that's gonna be the hardest thing for all y'all. Um, eat well, train, train a lot. Honestly, that's, that's it, you know? Now, obviously, I can't speak for, like, you'll never die. Well, everyone's gonna die. <laughs> I mean, I don't think you can stop that, but certainly you could live for a very... Oh, I got that one already. Oh! So they blacked out if I already have it. Got it, got it. Wow, interesting, interesting. So all I have is the cave, and then we're going to go on. Got Because I'll, I'll tell you guys, my grandpa on my dad's side, he passed away at maybe 108, 110. <laughs> you know, very long time. 
you know. But that was in Laos, and he was a monk too, you know. So, you know, he's not drinking, not smoking, not uh, the air is probably a lot, you know, better, you know, a lot less industrial, cleaner air, stuff like that, um, you know. And then the, the monk thing, so you know, um, not eating to full. <laughs> Uh, we're very good at that in America, you know, we eat till we're full. Well, not really. I think we eat when we're more than full and then eat more, but, you know, regardless. Um... Okay, are these maps? What are these? The map, tell me. No. Well, now I want to know what it is, guys. <laughs> oh, my curiosity, what is it? Yeah, let's find out what that is. Is it the monolith? Hmm, I don't think so. Uh oh, to the right. Oh. Oh, it's up there. Okay. Hmm, maybe I should find out what's over there. How do I get up there? Oh, that's a start, I guess. Yeah! I see. Interesting. What's this? Archivist map. Oh, cool. Okay. Did I get this already? Uh, oh, I'm full. I'm full of feathers. <sighs> Let's go to the next one. There's another... Where is it? I went from here. Okay, how do I go to that one? Oh, do I just climb through that one, I think? Ouch! <laughs> yeah, right. Let me, um... Uh, excuse me. Who's up? Oh. Oh, no! Should I jump on this rock? Wait, this is the Mongolian thing, right? These characters look... Yeah. Mongolian. But I can't read what it says. Hmm. We'll try this one. Um, where's the next one? Jeez, that's high. Well, wait, that branch will take me there, right? So how about... Here we go. Ah, it's too high. Hey, come on. Come on. Oh, here we go. Okay, so I'm going to jump to this one. Oh, that was too far. Wait a second. That's the thing that I saw last time. <laughs> I knew it. I knew I was looking at the wrong thing. I have learned all I can from the carnage inside the prophet's tomb. My brothers were slain to the last man sometime within the last few days. The false prophet's followers died here by the hundreds, but in the end, they were victorious. I have sealed the tomb as best I can and told the men of the nearby village that the prophet is at last dead. I left them with a the subtle threat that this place should remain hidden. I do not know if the prophet survived, but I will follow their trail. No one escapes the order of Trinity. Okay, well, let's see. We got the archivist map, so it tells me everything here, right? Oh, look at that. There's a document. Map. Another document. Ooh, a relic. Ooh, another document. Okay, I like this thing. Oh, well, we can't go in there. <laughs> and the monolith. Right. But I don't speak Mongolian yet. Okay, let's get the other doc. Oh, wait, is that what I was trying to get? How are we going to go there? How about this way? Oh my gosh. Jump this way! Whee! Oh, okay. That's how I get there. Mm, but is there another... Well, let's try. Let's, yeah. 
take me to the other one. Oh. He didn't take me to the other one. Okay, so there's a document over here. I'm get are you Oh you're up there. How did whoosh Whoosh Hey Where was the oh I'm looking at the wrong thing. There's the document. Ah we have told the people of the Valley City that we will attack at dawn, but we shall advance behind the Karash at moonrise. The captives we kept from the battles in the West will be our shields as we advance. Few survived the long march across the mountains, but those that live will serve their purpose to the Horde. The city sparkles, a gift not yet given. We will take what is ours and march home with our spoils. Oh, isn't that nice? Okay. Oh, we can translate Mongolian. I can speak Mongolian and Greek. I'm so educated. Yeah, we don't have rope arrows and we don't have um, a, a gun <laughs> to break through there. So, let us get the other document. And then we'll go for the relic. Oh, it's right there, huh? Uh, excuse me? Wait a second, I must have missed this thing. It's in front of my face somewhere. Wait, is it above me? Huh? Scramble up trees. Okay, maybe it's over here. Hold up. I'm so confused right now. I need to hit this thing. Oh, oh my gosh. Alright, you know what? It's okay. Let's do the other thing. The relic. And the cave. Right here. Ah! What is it? What is it? A crown from one of the princes of Kiev. How did it come to be all the way out here? What am I looking for? Eh? Nani? Someone was wearing it when they were killed. Oh. I see. Oh, we need to read the Mongolian thing. Okay. Wait, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? <laughs> to my right. Most of the writing is in praise of a military victory, but it looks like they left something nearby. Ooh, coin caches. Right here. Ooh, a lot of them. Three? God damn! Your money is mine, boy. Seven bucks. Great. You can afford a chicken dinner. Not in this economy. Okay, another one over there. Ooh. There's something. Whatever. Whatever, guys. Whatever. 
down here. Ooh. Damn. I gotta climb back up. Alright, the last money is. Um, 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 um. Right there. Wait a second. Up. Oh. I think the Henley looks better than the leather jacket, so let's go with that. How do I? Oops. Yeah. Wee. Blue Henley. Blue's my favorite color, but I feel like navy oh, uh, army green looks better on me. Got to look into that sometime. So over there. Show me the money! How much do they have? Oh, it's down there. Oh. Seven bucks. Ah, keep giving me seven bucks. Now hold on, the cave is right here. <laughs> Wait a second. What? what? Oh, mushrooms. Okay. Thought it was animal predation. A lot of vines. I wonder if we can burn those. Oh, wait a second. These are magnesite core? Let's get those. Okay. What is this? Ah. The Prophet and his followers have been traveling under cover of night, a crooked trail around the border of the Eastern Empire. I do not know where they are headed, and I suspect they do not either. But they know we will not let them rest until this heresy is purged. The common folk of the borderlands give him shelter, and I find it curious that none who have aided him will tell me anything of use. Even when I threaten them with the wrath of Trinity or touch the edge of a knife to their throats, they stay silent. They die, never betraying what they know. The prophet has a curious sway over people. All the more reason he must be silenced. Mm-hmm. Ooh, that's another magazine core. Yeah, let's get that one. Let's get that one too. Well, I guess that's it for the cave. Nothing particularly impressive. But that's okay. Okay, well. I guess we can move on. If this document isn't gonna let me get it. Which it isn't. Maybe it's for later when, like, you... Finish part of the story or something. Okay. Let's. Oh! Let me try one more time. There we go. We saw. Deep snow. Yes, that's true. <laughs> I've walked through it before. Uh oh. Please respond. We got some interference on that last transmission. Oh, it's a bear. Oh. Ouch. He got me real good, man. Ugh. I think I know what happened to, to Survey Team. <laughs> 
Get out of here, boy. Get out of here, boy. It's up. Oh, boy. <laughs> He's a tough one. He's not going to go after us. I feel like the bear would. <laughs> I really think the bear would. He'd be like, I don't give a damn. <laughs> Lara, refusing to use the door again, I see. But it's faster this way, Dad. Come here, you little monkey. <laughs> Are you going on another adventure? Yes. My greatest one yet. Well, I've decided that I should be your assistant. Oh, have you? Well, there's no one I'd rather have by my side. But this business, it, it's too dangerous. Laura, listen to me. Someday, you're going to make such a mark on this world. You're going to make me so proud. Give me a moment, darling. I need to take this. I'm still alive. I think. Ah. Got to find this wound. Healing resources. Ooh. A healing salve. Those leashes done the bleeding. <laughs> Need some kind of bandage. Okay. An abandoned Cold War installation. What the hell is Trinity doing down there? Hold the heel. Yeah. Big Bear. <laughs> How am I gonna stop Big Bear? I don't know, he's a tough one. Tough boy. Those mushrooms, they're death caps. I should be able to make a poison. Oh, poison. That's a good idea. Usually if you're fighting a tough foe and they're just too strong, poison's a good thing. It's going to drain their strength the more they, the more active they are, you know? Come on. Alright. Break this. Salvage. What do you want me to do? Oh, this? Okay. Whee! You gonna let me get the document yet? No. Actually, hold on. <clears throat> it's almost time for me to go to bed, guys. We gotta go to sleep. We're going to the range tomorrow. Wait, that's the bear? Hold on, hold on. Lara, you gotta make poison arrows first. Oh, let's go back here. Okay, okay. There we go. Much better. Make the poison arrows and then we'll start again. Well, could be tomorrow, actually. Since I go to the range, I don't uh, I don't train. I let my body rest, have a good range session. It's going to be the AP5M, the MP5K gun. That one has not been working too well for me, but, <clears throat> you know... People keep saying to shoot 124 instead of 115, so I'm like, okay, I'll try it, you know, if it works, that's that's good, but, you know, I do need the MP5K to use 115, because that is the ammo that I use for all my fighting guns, I'm not going to have a completely different ammunition for a gun, that's ridiculous, you know, if I can help it, I'm, gonna, I'm not going to do that. Um, <clears throat> where do I make the poison arrows? 
Probably in weapons. No, these are for the weapon itself. Hmm. Well, it's not going to be skills. I don't have any skill points. Inventory. Yeah, these are just um, equipment upgrades. I must not be able to make it yet. Okay, well, you know what? That's okay. That's fine. Um, I think we'll stop it here. Thank you guys for watching. This is episode one of Rise of the Tomb Raider. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you next time, okay? Bye now.